I've been fortunate in that I've worked steadily over all these years and I've fulfilled at least one ambition, which was to work in the archers. Radio has always been my favorite medium, perhaps because I started in it. And after radio, I love theater because it's, it's dangerous. There's something exciting about theater. There's no hiding place. It's frightening even. And every performance is different because you're communicating with a live audience. And you don't get that anywhere else. There is a live audience in, in television sitcom, but the feel is quite different because uh, you're playing to the live audience in the studio, yes, but you're primarily playing also to the audience at home. I have been in many sitcoms in my time, from the rag trade to uh, an Asian Yorkshire woman from Barnsley in Langley Bottom and uh, <laughs> a nun in Father Charlie and a somewhat naive woman trying to learn English in evening classes in Mind Your Language. This was extremely popular at the time when it went out but after th three series it was cancelled because it was regarded as politically incorrect. However, it's still selling and still playing in many countries abroad, even after 30 odd years. When we moved to Wales, everyone said, why are you going so far away from London? You'll find it awfully difficult to get work from there. But Wales has its compensations and I love it. And contrary to expectations, I have continued to work. Maybe not as much, but enough. I'm content. When I was young, there weren't very many Asian actors. And so I got whatever work I did go up for. However, as time went on, there was more work. And at the same time, I was a lot older. <laughs> and there's not a vast amount of work for older uh, actresses, especially brown ones. Still, I'm lucky to be working at all. Age shouldn't really be a barrier, not in the acting profession at least. I once worked with Joyce Carey and she still remembered her lines from Romeo and Juliet and when she spoke them you didn't see a beautiful lady with white hair. No, you saw a young girl in love. That is suspension of disbelief. Magic. It's said that you're as old as you feel. True. But sometimes what you feel doesn't match up with where you are physically. Nevertheless, age does have its compensations. And a positive outlook does make for a brighter life.